What is going on my niggas Black Bigelow here today and I have a review for you that I paid for, bitch. Okay, I was at McDonald's getting my coffee. Now I'm supposed to be on my diet where I fast. I haven't really lost any weight in the last month and a half. I've just been maintaining and you know living a normal life so so far so good so i'm hoping that i'm regular but i'm not going to be doing a lot of these fast food reviews so don't be asking me oh let's pay for it so i seen something at mcdonald's that the only reason why i'm trying is because i have never seen it before in my life and that is the um the mcdonald's steak egg and cheese bagel sandwich um, never seen a bagel sandwich at McDonald's. I'm sure they've had it before. I just don't pay attention to this shit. Uh, oh, no, my bad. It's called the bacon, egg, and cheese bagel. Stupid, it's not a bacon, egg, and... Whatever I said. Bacon, egg, and cheese bagel. I could have sworn it said steak. No, it is steak. Yeah, I, I was right the first time. Anyways. All right. So this is what it looks like. It was $4.99. It's greasy as shit. I ain't gonna lie, that does look kind of good, even for McDonald's. How's this for the thumbnail? Can we do that? Or how about this? Get that grease on there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, whatever one I'll choose. Okay, so I'm not gonna eat this whole damn thing. I just can't do it. Um, I don't. I'll eat like one fourth of it and throw it away. I don't know. It looks good. It doesn't smell that good, but it looks good. Let's give this bitch a try. All right, let's go. One, two, three. That is greasy as hell. This thing is greasy as. hell. Hell. Man, I don't even need to put Carmix on my lips for like the last, uh, for the next three days. I know a lot of you niggas out there are like, damn, that nigga's sexy. <laughs> Fuck it. I think it has onions on it too. Yeah, it does. All right, one more bite. Okay, let's wipe my disgusting mouth. Um, okay, is it, first of all, you know, when I rate food, I always think about the price in there too. I should start talking about the price of things more. Is it worth $4.99? Um, if you're a YouTube baller like me, you're just balling out of control and $4.99 ain't nothing, then it's worth it. Um, if you're a part-time YouTuber, full-time dishwasher, and you're going into McDonald's and, you know, they're asking $4.99 for this sandwich, I would say it is worth it for every once in a blue moon. Like, I wouldn't buy that if I was, like, a, you know, part-time YouTuber, full-time dishwasher. But since I'm a full-time YouTube baller, and I'm just, I got it like that. You know what's so funny? I was at a convenience store. I was on live, and, uh, this lady, she had this bag of beef jerky, right? And she's like, hey, how, how much is this? I said, baby, what? Is that a convenience store? What is it, $25? Just buy it. Just get it. You want it. Ballin'. What am I going to do? Ask somebody how much something is? I just buy it, baby. Just rag it. Baby, just grab whatever you want. That's how I am. Like, if you date me, like, get whatever you want, baby. Don't even act. Just get it. Because the money's coming. I'm a success story. Living in my van. Anyways. Um... But that being said, um, taste. Is it, does it taste good? Uh, yeah. Uh, I, it, to me, it wasn't hot enough. Uh, that thing could have stood being put in the microwave for another 20 seconds. Uh, the bagel was okay. Um, it was soft. It wasn't too hard. It wasn't too, you know, whatever, doughy. Uh, the onions w were good. It's, it's good on the bagel, right? Uh, the cheese was fine. Uh, I like the grease. Uh, you know, you could do a lot of things with grease. You know what I'm saying? I could, I could put it. Uh... 
with that being said, um, value-wise, taste-wise, uh, I'm going to give that sandwich a 6.5. Okay, if it was a, if it was a little hotter, it'd probably be 6.8. So, next time you're in uh, Virginia or Maryland or wherever the fuck I'm at, I think I'm in Virginia. Uh, go ahead and give that a try. Uh, you might like it. All right, so anyways, I hope you enjoyed my review, and I will catch up with you on the next one. By the way, guys, if you want me to review something for you, uh, hit me up uh, Hit me up on Cash App or PayPal. And yes, uh, anybody that I still owe reviews to, um, I only owe uh, Mr. Pfeiffer. Is that you? With the, what's the Monster Slim Jim? Or somebody. Uh, yeah. All right, very good. I'll catch up with you all later. Peace out.